Hey, it's Pinoy Gamers, and I'm going to show you how to edit NPCs. And the program you need is called NPC Editor. It's still in beta, but it works pretty good. Once you download it, install it, and it should come up like this. And Skyrim NPC Editor. Open that up. It's going to index every NPC and list them all. There. There it is. And here is what it shows the NPC and this is the place where you edit it. The template I use is called Stormcloak Archer and now you can make your own NPC to your liking. There's tabs, info, stats, factions, inventory, spells, appearance, and the AI packs which you cannot use right now. In order to, m to change its armor you need to go to its default outfit and then just look for the armor you want. If you want a companion's outfit or a dwarven, let's just pick a dwarven for now. It's going to show you right here, armor, dwarven, outfit. A sleeping outfit is when it's going to go to sleep and you could, it's not really important. And combat style is when how it fights. So if you wanted to make a mage, you would go to combat mage, which is somewhere here. Soldier magic, or that's it. And other stuff, there's goats, horker, hare, I don't know, maybe a horse. And stats is where you actually edit its health and magicka and stamina. So if you were to make it 5,000 health, billion magicka, and negative 10 stamina. Well, that's not going to work. One stamina. And that's how you change it. You can also change its one hand, archery, smithing, and all that stuff in here. If you go to factions, it will show you the factions it's in. Currently, it's in the Suns faction, is which it's um, the... It's in the Stormcloaks faction. And if you were to add it into another faction, you go here to and type in your faction. Bandit. Bandit faction. And you just add it a rank. Delete the other. Now it's a bandit. Wow, nice. If you wanted to give it a weapon. You just type in the um the weapon name right here. If you want to give it a Daedric great sword, you just give it one. Go give the count to one. That's it. If you wanted to add spells, um, you just type in the spells here like fireball, fireball. There. Now it has learned fireball and it would use it. Only if it were to have its combat style to magic. Now its appearance is where you just edit its face. So you could just edit the hair. Yeah, there. Edit its beard. It's mesh fail right there. And you could edit its eyes and brows and marks, which is the scars. That's it. And. That's pretty much it. If you go to create mod, it would create an ESP mod, ENC Siege Suns Archer template. What to do with it? You have to go to the data file for for the Skyrim. So go to Steam, Steam Apps, Common, Skyrim, and into data, and you paste it in here save in here yep confirm save as file is created remember to include related mesh file in meshes folder when applying the mod okay you don't need to. so currently i'm in game and i'm going to show you the npc we just created the template we used was called stormcloak archer so you have to search up the object id which is you could do is help stormcloak Archer 4. Then it will bring you four different object IDs, but you could use any. Player, place that me. 
two FFA set that spawns use this guy. Uh, yeah. yeah. He fights like a horse with him. Oh, yeah. Never mind. So that's how you make your own NPC. Now go make your own. I'll NPC spare you. Now. See you later, guys.